Hey guys, Chris's Toy Tube here. Today I bring you Kool Aid Man. This guy is so awesome. He's wearing Hawaiian shorts. He's got his groovy glasses because we all know the Kool Aid Man's groovy. Little pitcher so you can pour yourself a drink if you're thirsty. Um, this I believe my mom got when I was a kid with Kool Aid points. I'm not sure if they still have those or not. But back in the 80s, you could get all kinds of super cool stuff for free. All you had to do was cut out the proof of purchase. In Kool-Aid's case, they had little points on the back of the packages. And you could get a catalog by mail and you save your points. And you get cool stuff like this. Kool-Aid! And here he is without the glasses. Um, I believe the approximate year for him is 1987. I did a little bit of research today on the internet on this guy. I was not able to find him with, actually, I was able to find him one place with the glasses. Um, it was another collectible website. I don't remember what the name of the website was. Um, they had about 18 of them for sale at one point, but because they have no more left, I have no clue what they were asking for them. And I went to eBay and I did a search. I could not find any on eBay with the sunglasses. I found them with this groovy Hawaiian shorts here. I think the detail on the shorts is pretty cool. I mean, look at the, the trees and I don't know. I just like it. But anyway, on eBay, I found him for sale starting from $9.99 and going all the way up to $34.99. Again, that was without the glasses. So, I don't know. I think I'm going to hold on to this guy for a little bit longer. See where the value of it goes. Maybe see if one does pop up on eBay with the glasses. He's a little dirty. I just dug him off of my shelf. Maybe I should have cleaned his glasses up for you guys. But I don't know why people wouldn't have kept the glasses. They are sewed on. You can see they're, they're tacked on just a little bit right there. Um, I tried to look through them. I mean, you, you can't even see through them. So I don't know what the purpose would have been for removing the glasses. But then again, if this was something that somebody got for a child, kids will be kids. It's kind of weird to imagine that I've had this thing since 1987. I guess I just took really good care of it. That was a real cool thing about my mom, guys. She always used to send off for the all this super cool free stuff. And as I find things, I will be bringing you more super groovy vintage 80s toys. Even some of these freebie type items. So I hope you enjoyed my review of the Kool-Aid Man. Chris's Toy Tube, don't forget to give us a like, subscribe, go check out our Facebook page, Chris's Toy Tube on Facebook. And you guys have a great day. See you next time. Bye.